It is Monday, May 18th, 2009. Six years ago today, I went to my senior prom. I remember that date. I just do. I biked all of my errands today and I got my hair cut. Yay! But I'm sorry the video is a little late. I just was out bicycling all my errands and that takes longer than driving, clearly. So, all right. Um, the question this week we are talking about um, goal. Kestrel Sky asked, What are you looking forward to feeling slash doing once you have reached goal? And where do you plan to go from there? So, this question is very two part for me because I am almost at goal. <laughs> I'm 163 point something. I'm about three pounds away from my goal that I set myself in January 2008 when I set out to lose weight. So that's my goal and I'm almost there. So it's almost like wh what am I going to be doing very soon? So the question seems very pressing to me. But I also have a dream goal to be 150 or to at least look 150, which is going to take a lot of hard work and strength training and fat burning and probably giving up alcohol and other fats that I would otherwise eat to try and get my body as trim as I want it. So that's a second goal, and that would be kind of a better way to answer this question. So anyway, what do I look forward to doing at goal? Um, making my goal video. Honestly, I'm really excited about it. It's going to be a lot of work and I'm sort of feeling overwhelmed by it, but it's going to, I'll chip away at it and I'll do it and it'll be really great. And I'm really excited to show you guys old pictures of me and kind of really show the whole journey because I've never done anything like that. What will I do when I get to dream? What am I looking forward to at dream goal? I'm looking forward to wearing a bikini. I know I mentioned this in my second video ever. I have just never had that, never been there. I've never experienced this. But when I see women wearing bikinis, all I can think is, ah, I want to look like that. And I, I don't even want their bodies. I just want to be able to wear this little bathing suit and just feel very sexy and confident. And mm, I will get there. I don't, I don't want a string bikini, but something kind of athletic y sassy yeah I just I'm really excited that's it sounds so silly but that is it yeah wearing a bikini my answer is not that exciting now the second part of the question which I'll touch on for a second where do you plan to go from there well when I hit goal of 160 where do I plan to go from there um, increase my strength training and increase my cardio Probably I want to deny running a bit more and start doing uh, cross training start doing spinning classes more, doing Zumba, um, doing weight training, kettlebells and abs ball, and I'm probably going to start taking the step class at 24 Hour Fitness. So I'm really going to change it up. When I hit 160, I'm still going to run once or twice a week because I love running. And in fact, I could do strength training and running on the same day because running is not, it's cardio for me, but it's not as strenuous as like a class is for me now. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to switch it up and, um, really try and focus on getting the fat off of my body and toning my body so I have shape, I have, you can see definition of my muscles and my whole figure is just, I, I want to keep changing it. And um, when I get to dream goal, what am I going to do? Keep on keeping on. Hopefully start setting personal goals for myself in running and bicycling, which I do quite a bit of as well, and start trying to increase my athleticism in those two sports, increase my endurance, increase my speed. And um, eventually, I would like to do um, swimming as well and someday do a triathlon. That's been a goal of mine since forever. So when I get to 150, the goal is just then to continue to develop my athletic abilities and um, continue to spread my feelers as I become more athletic and, and kind of get into the community. Perhaps I'll do some um, bike races, you know, where I just participate to participate and some running races. I'm going to be doing one in August. Um, I hope we're still on for that, Alicia. And um, yeah, just try and slowly over the years work my way up to being a triathlete. Not like a competitive triathlete, just one who does triathlons. 
I hope that answers your question. Thank you for asking. It's kind of fun to talk about it and really think about, okay, where am I going? Especially now that I'm so close. Stay tuned tomorrow for Natalie and the rest of the week, and I will see you next week when I am back from California and probably will be exhausted and in airplane hair again.